Awesome. Hi, I'm Troy Campbell. I'm from Duke University, and I'm at the APS conference in Chicago. And this project is with my colleague Ed O'Brien at the University of Michigan, and our professors Peter Ubel, Leif Van Boven, and Norbert Schwartz. And um, uh, what uh, we did in this project is we repeatedly exposed people to a picture of Lady Gaga, and then we asked them how would other people who had never seen these Lady Gaga pictures before react to these pictures, um, and uh, specifically how shocked would they be by these pictures. And the question is, is this extra experience with Lady Gaga images making them better at predicting how unexposed others would react to the content or worse? Now the lay intuition, which is often supported by a certain reading of the empathy literature, would say that all this experience is going to make you wiser and a better predictor. However, we find the opposite, and that this extra experience with Lady, Lady Gaga makes people worse at predicting how others will react. And you can think of it like when you hear a joke for the hundredth time, you're not as me amused by that joke as you were the first time you heard it or anybody else would be amused the first time they heard it. And since we use the way we feel about things to predict how others would react, if you use how you feel about that joke on the hundredth time, and don't account for how rep repeated exposure has influenced how you feel about that joke now, then you're gonna make some terrible predictions for how people unexposed to the joke will react to this. And what's interesting is when we show these experiments to other people, they repeatedly and overwhelmingly think that the people who have the repeated exposure, those in the repeated exposure condition, will be better at predicting how unexposed others will react to emotional content, and we find the exact opposite. And so what we're finding is an error on both sides of the equation, is that people who have more experience are worse at predicting how others will react, but unexposed others think that this experience is making them better. And so why the research is important is that you have people going to the people for advice who are actually worse at giving them advice, and in the end, they'll end up experiencing worse emotive experiences. And so, yeah, that's our project. Thank you very much.